front of you is for five million six hundred and fifty five thousand two hundred and twenty dollars which is four hundred forty eight thousand five hundred and nine or eight point six percent greater than um, the 2018 default budget then it kind of breaks down just like I did in the other ones that wages makes up 45.67 percent of their budget yeah. contracts make up 25.92 percent of their overall budget gasoline and gasoline and diesel is 2.23 utilities is 6.77 and other items is 19.42 percent okay good. and it just kind of shows that to you in the graph the different um, pieces of their budget as a whole and then this is the pie chart um, this is some this is just like I had done for all the other ones so it's basically showing you that the breakdown of the 8.61 percent increase for public works and that's showing you the large piece of the pie there in the blue yeah. is contracts make up 6.18 percent of his 8.61 percent increase now this just is not labor is, contracts no no no. this is a contracts all. in the public works budget that have all been approved by the voters in <clears throat> one way or another as appropriations to be expended it could be anywhere from trash um uniform uniform two new trucks lease of the lease of the trash trucks is the big one there i think that's 124,000 yep. and then the rest of the pie showing you the other items actually that don't fall into one of the categories that we talked about which could be considered items that are more of the yeah. leisurely type for the departments or whatever he's actually at a <laughs> negative uh 0.52 percent so um the other items there really go to show that there's nothing in this budget other than things that have been previously approved the contracts for that you were referring to rusty for uh wages would be under the collective bargaining i mean would be under the wages i, I get so that but i just want to make sure that the public knew yes mm -hmm. when we said contracts that that was not wages oh okay, yes that it's not is wages. stuff that we've already approved correct and then we have signed contracts to finish right yes so so just to be more clear to the public those contracts are, give an example of one of those contracts well uh, if i can start that you know that we've signed a contract it was a warrant article for two new uh, to lease two new dump trucks, mm -hmm. trash trucks. I shouldn't call them dump trucks. They, we no longer go to a yeah. dump. Refuse collection vehicles. Yeah. The lease on those two vehicles is 124000 It's going to be in the budget for the next five years. This is the first time it actually appears in the budget, so it looks like it's an increase. Um, <coughs> landfill groundwater monitoring. Because it's been mandated by the state that we yeah. test for PF. OAs and PFOSs is an increase of $17,000. I mean, where that was normally just a small $3,000 item. Waste tipping fees are, you know, we're into a third year of a five year contract with waste management. That's going up $55,000. Yeah. Um, just so people know, waste tipping fee, what does that mean? Uh, for every ton of trash that we deposit at waste management, um, mm -hmm. They're charging us. It started out at 62. It's now up to like 64. Yeah. It's the the finite numbers right here in the book. But um, so all those contractual things we have, the hauling goes yeah. seems by contract it goes up. I think three percent per year. Um, that's that's going to go up 65,000. So I I went through the budget today and just on a piece of paper added up all those things <laughs> um, of the 400,000. That it looks like we're up. 377,000 of those items are uh, contractual in nature, um, to the point that you know you, you can't break the contracts. Yeah. Um, 